Welcome back to the News at 10. An anthropology professor at Montana Tech and Butte has written a book with some out of this world views on the UFO phenomenon. MTN's John Amy tells us about the professor who believes in identified flying objects. Some people believe UFOs visit Earth from planets far, far away. But a Montana Tech professor believes UFOs are much closer to home. The phenomenon may be our own distant descendants coming back through time to study us in their own evolutionary past. Masters writes about this theory in his latest book, Identified Flying Objects. With a doctorate in anthropology from Ohio State University, Masters uses science to explain why people who report close encounters with aliens always describe them the same way. These extra tempestrials are ubiquitously reported as being bipedal, upright walking, having five fingers on each hand and foot, the same way that we do, bilateral symmetry, that they have you know, two eyes, a mouth, a nose, they can communicate with us in our own languages. While he understands this study is considered fringe science, Masters defends the research in his book. And, and I stand by the product. I'm happy to, to talk about it with anyone. It's written for my academic peers as much as it is for anyone in the UFO community. And here's the point in the story where the journalist usually makes a flippant comment about little green men to show he doesn't take it that seriously. But the U.S. Defense Department spent $22 million investigating the UFO phenomenon. And that's why Dr. Masters believes it's time for scientists to take a serious approach to the study of this phenomenon. The hope is that we can begin a new dialogue and get past some of the stigma and not have to um, defend this as, as science because it is very scientific itself. In Butte, John Amy, MTN News. Now Masters has been on several radio and television programs here and abroad to discuss his book and he will appear on the national radio show Coast to Coast AM next week.